everyone, Pastor Joe. Hey, thanks for giving me a minute. What an incredible weekend. I know it was raining a lot, and yet you guys are always so faithful, uh, even in difficult times. People watching online, Palm Bay to land, it, just a great weekend. I don't have all the numbers yet, uh, but we'll, uh, we'll get you some of that information later. I mostly want to say thank you. Uh, as I walk around this church, I am constantly amazed, the church building, and watch the church in action. I see Bible studies, I see prayer groups, I see the food pantry, I see two new church plants going on on Friday night. Um, I watch people bring in uh, the, the diapers and the formula and the wipes and all that for the, the children in the disaster up in Kentucky, the food for the schools, the food for special projects that we do, uh, plus the, the money that you bring in. Uh, we're finishing up our uh, the disaster relief this, this week where we need about 5,000 more. Just to finish that off, we've helped in Costa Rica, uh, we've helped in Kentucky, West Virginia, Tennessee, Kentucky, with all of the flooding and all the crazy stuff that's gone on. And so we've been involved with all that. And again, it, none of that can happen without your constant uh, giving, your prayers, your faithfulness to worship. Um, so I just say thank you for that. So we did have our first gathering, our core group for our church plant in Bunnell. We had 40 people uh, somewhere or other was connected with that. We're excited that's gonna launch strong. Uh, it's gonna be uh, just service for a while up there at the, church, at the school and then start a Bible study and then eventually we'll get a church going hopefully by March of next year. So if you wanna help be a part of that plant, get a hold of Kyle Holgram. He's doing a great, great job for us on staff. So the real push is for for our short-term mission trips, which will be on the table next weekend. And uh, we're gonna have 40, 50 trips maybe, uh, even more if we can get leaders to do it. But we encourage you to come and think about, man, maybe you've never done this before, ask some questions, sign up. We wanna have twice as many people go on missions this year next year than we've ever had before. So that means we need about 100 or 150 new people that have never tried this to say, you know what, I'm gonna go serve God. I'm gonna give that week, I'm gonna give those 10 days. I'm gonna go and let God use me and let God change me. Now this weekend, we'll be looking at Paul in Ephesus. We're in chapter 19 of the book of Acts. So there's two or three sections in there that we'll cover, uh, but just read the whole chapter and you'll kind of be ready to go. I love being your pastor and I'll see you somewhere, somehow, this weekend.